Hi, this is Chris again at SRQ Fishing Oasis. Um, I do a lot of rod and reel repair, but I get a lot of questions about what type of oil or what type of grease to use when you're uh, when you're cleaning your own rods and reels. Um, uh, the the biggest thing that I use it are these Inox products. Um, they're phenomenal products. They're they're really good for uh, corrosion resistance, um, which is a must in salt water. I mean, you're gonna you're gonna deal with corrosion when you're dealing with salt water. So I like to coat my rods and my reels with this stuff. Um, the uh, the Lanox is good for uh, it's good to spray on bearings. It's good to spray your reel down with your trailer, your your rods. You can pretty much do anything with the Lanox. The MX4 is good for everything too, except you can't really spray it onto uh, anything that's rubber or neoprene or anything like that because it's not really safe for rubber. It'll over time it'll deteriorate rubber. So I I kind of stay away from the MX3 unless you're just you know spraying it on chains or on metal metal surfaces or you know that type of thing um, I use the Lanox a lot but uh, as far as grease and oil goes oil I use three-in-one oil uh, you can you can get this pretty much anywhere hardware stores um, you can buy it at Lowe's or Home Depot Walmart I think carries it too um, I like I really like this is good for bearings you want to put this on your bearings um, grease, I use uh, Super Lube. It's the best grease that I've found. It's kind of pricey. Um, a tube this size, I think, is like six or seven bucks. Um, but it's it's really good grease. Um, you can find it. Uh, I, I think I buy mine at Harbor Freight. Um, I don't know where else carries it. I haven't really looked, but um, this is really good stuff. The only time you wouldn't be able to use this is if you're in a climate that's it's extremely cold. I think it's only good for uh, minus 45 degrees Fahrenheit, something like that. Um, but um, the good thing about it is it doesn't, it, the excess heat, um, it's safe up to 400 degrees Fahrenheit. So you don't have to worry about, with like a lot of other greases, um, if it gets, you know, 100 degrees outside, if you leave it in your car or something, a lot of times the grease will will become like an oil and, and it kind of loses the effect. The grease will come off of your gears or whatever you're trying to grease. Um, it'll kind of run off, but it doesn't do that with this. And uh, I just use a, a little brush to apply it. I don't even know where I got this little brush, but um, any little brush works fine. You, know, you want to brush it onto the gears and your reels. Um, as far as that goes, this is pretty much what I use. Um, and I, I do sell the Inox products, but the other stuff, you know, you can just go to the hardware store or something and buy it. Uh, well, that's it.